Hey, so greetings and salutations, everybody. My name is Axe, and I hope you're enjoying your wonderful day today. It is a Tuesday, uh, so I hope things are going well for you. I hope that your day is good. If it's not, uh, hopefully I can make that a bit better. That's kind of my goal. That's kind of why I like doing videos, and that's why I like I like this channel. I love doing all this. Anyways, enough of that. The point is, is that uh, I guess I will get to the video. So today, I kind of wanted to do a commentary. I haven't done a commentary in a while. Uh, I want to... Just because, I don't know, I enjoy talking about things. It's just kind of feeling that moment in which something is really appropriate to talk about that uh, I wait for. And once that comes, like now, I kind of go with it. And so today I wanted to talk about something that uh, has, I guess, affected me personally in life. But I think a lot of people struggle with because it's a common human thing. And uh, physically, you would be described as the mirror. And in the sense of looking at a reflection of ourselves and specifically, I guess, in the mirror, because I feel that many people looking in the mirror, looking in a mirror, I should say, do not like what they see because a mirror reflects us. A mirror shows us what we really are and it makes us doubt a lot of things about us that we would probably think true if we weren't looking at it because we see all of our flaws. We know our flaws. So by looking in a mirror, it's presented right in front of you and saying, here it is. Here's your stuff. Physically, and then by thinking physically, generally that will spur up some deeper emotional feelings of, well, I look bad, now I can't do this or that, and this and that and that. And the mirror is a scary place because we see more than other people do. And we forget that, I think, a lot of the time. We think that everybody can see the flaws and the horrible things that we see when truthfully they can't. Um, I don't know. Personally, there was quite a long period in my life that I looked in the mirror and I hated what I saw and I kind of denied it and pushed that under the bus because I didn't want thinking that I couldn't those thoughts were stuff I like there was a lot of things going on and I didn't want to think of those thoughts but for a long time I looked in the mirror and I did not like what I saw because I saw myself and not just physically but mentally and emotionally like I said I started bringing up all these things of like well you know, you and this and who would want to be with you and yeah it was harsh and horrible on myself I know uh, now but at the time it seemed so real and true because that was a lot of not a lot of that was a good deal of my struggles I did not like myself as a person I did not like what I looked like I thought I was trapped and I felt like I was just there I don't know I felt like I was merely existing for another moment and it was a horrible horrible time um, and I can't get too far into it just because that would take up a lot of time. But um, through the years or so, I, through this last year, I've recovered from a lot of things that I had going on in my life. And I feel that at this point in my life, I'm legitimately happy and I want to feel things. And I look in the mirror now, like today, I even just looked in the mirror and I, I'm like, yes, yes, I'm happy with how I look. I'm happy with who I am. And I think of all the things in my life and I just... I can't stop. I can't not smile. I mean, it's amazing. And some, I don't know, people have told me in the past, some some people in my life, I just, they just said some things that a mirror is all about how you frame it. You might, you know, you might think it's like this, but other people will see other things. And you can't forget that a mirror is a reflection of yourself. It's the opposite. It's what you see in the mirror is not what other people see of you. It's a reflection and so you can't forget that, you know, when you look in that mirror, there will be stuff that you don't like and there will be stuff that you do like, hopefully. But other people do not see what you are seeing in that mirror. They see you in person and they see you for you. And don't let a mirror and don't let those self-conscious thoughts get in the way of things in life. And for those who are in that position of just total dislike towards a mirror and do not even want to look at one in some cases... Um, words can be cheap and words can sound really interesting when everybody just throws a lot of hopeful crap at you, uh, when you're in that mood. But if you are in that state and if you're in a place of not feeling well with yourself and who you are, just know that you have the power to change that and you can do things in your life eventually that, uh, can really, really, really make you feel good about yourself. So anyways, that is it for today, guys. I know a bit deeper, a bit more of that, a bit more chill, but uh, not chill combo, you know what I mean. And anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed. Hope you have an amazing day, guys and girls. And yeah, um, thank you very much. Thank you very much for contributing to this happiness that is now in my life. So <laughs> have a great day, everybody. Oh! Oh, he got it!
got him. We got him. We legitimately got him. What's that? This guy. Down there? No, no, no. Oh, shit. The flank. There he is. There he is. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. Get him. All right. Don't pursue, dude. Oh, there it is.